Okay, so let's give this a shot. Making a tower of tetrahedrons. Okay, so I'm going to start with three, but quickly I'm going to introduce the other three. And so to just start it off, I'm going to make little mini bubbles here. Um, one, two, three. And then I just going to twist these guys together. Just so that it doesn't come apart. And so now I'm going to introduce these other ones. Uh, one at a time. That away with this guy. Um. Okay, better add another white one in here. Last one, I'm going to be a bit sneaky. I'm going to actually go the same direction. So it's not quite symmetric in its, its uh, placement. Okay, so this one is going to go. So there's my almost tetrahedron, and this last one's going to finish it off, and it's going to go the same, the same location. Okay, anyway, there we have it the first tetrahedron, the first three there, and then in a way, what we have is. Um, the, the blue one going this direction, the white one going this direction, and the red one somehow going the same direction to this vertex. Okay, so we got three coming out of one, two, and one. Okay, so now the fun begins. Okay, let's, it doesn't matter, really matter too much what we do, so let's go this direction. Okay, so I'm going to start with the, where I've got three, I'm going to do red, I'm going to do blue. So notice that this new triangle has a white one there, so I can't choose this white one, but I must have a white one there, so I'm going to pull this final white one in here. Okay? And that sort of left uh, two of them out in the blue, and so I'm going to uh, do, uh, so that's the one spot I'm going to do these two now. Hmm, that's a little odd, isn't it? If I go here, what's going to happen to the, yeah, that's fine. Okay? So these two, like that, and I'm going to bring the white one in here, like so. And so now I'm going to do these two. I can't choose this red one to do it, so i got to do the blue, and so now it's the blue and the white. The nice thing about having these colors really help. I don't know if I could make this without having different colors. But once again, I can't choose this red, i got to choose the other one from the three pack, and so I bring it over. Okay, and so now what was left was this guy here. And so I'm going to bring this blue here and here. And the white one, I can't use that white one, so i got to use the other white one. So I bring him in. So this last one here, um, I'm going to have to use the white and the blue. And then I need another red one that's got to come from here. And now here, red and blue. Not this white one, because it's right there, so I've got to use this white one. And then not this red one, and so it's got to be um, this white, and the heart, this white, and this blue. Sorry, right. I'm not using the camera. I can't use this red one, so I've got to use this red one. Now I can't use the white, got to go blue and red. So it's a lot of alternation. So much alternation, can't use this white one, gotta use this white one. Can't use the red because looking at that edge, and so white. Um, can't use that with red, so gotta use this red.
can't use the white because that's the egg in common for this one. Can't use that white, gotta come over this one. The red egg is the one opposite or between these two points, so I can't use the red, use the blue and white. Can't use that red again, so I gotta go with this red. Bring that in. The egg is white, gotta go with the blue and the red. Can't use the white one, gotta go with the opposite white. Gotta use the white and the blue now. Can't use this red, must use this one.